we desire to give the Soviet people absolute liberty of voting for those they desire to elect those whom they trust to ensure their interests of all the treasures a state can possess the human lives of its citizens are for us the most precious have not fascism in Italy and National Socialism in Germany claim that they have attained similar results as in USSR have not both been achieved at the price of privation and personal liberty sacrificed for the good of the state the press must grow day in and day out it is our party's sharpest and most powerful weapon the art of leadership is a serious matter one must not lag behind a movement because to do so is to become isolated from the masses but one must not rush ahead for to rush ahead is to lose contact with the masses he who wished to lead a movement must conduct a fight on two fronts against those who lag behind and those who rush ahead this creature softened my heart of stone she died and with her died my last warm feelings for humanity at this point the question of Ukraine is the most important the situation in Ukraine is very bad if we don't take steps now to improve the situation we may lose Ukraine the objective should be to transform Ukraine in the shortest period of time into a real fortress of the USSR as you can see even when Adolf Hitler desires to speak for peace he cannot dispense with threats this is symptomatic it is not heroes that make history but history that makes heroes history has shown there are no invincible armies when you chop wood splinters fly each position each meter of the Soviet territory must be stubbornly defended to the last drop of blood we must cling to every inch of Soviet soil and defend it to the end the reason why there is now no communist government in Paris is because in the circumstances of 1945 the Soviet army was not able to reach French soil when there's a person there's a problem when there's no person there's no problem I believe in only one thing the power of human will undoubtedly 
our path is not of the easiest. But, just as undoubtedly, we are not to be frightened by difficulties. Paraphrasing from the well-known words of Luther, Russia might say, Here I stand on the frontier between the old capitalist world and the new socialist world. Here on this frontier, I unite the efforts of the proletarians of the West and of the peasantry of the East in order to shatter the old world. Nowadays wars are not declared. They simply start. A certain inequality in regard to property still exists in a socialist society. But in a socialist society, there is no unemployment no exploitation, no oppression of nationalities. This war is not as in the past. Whoever occupies a territory also imposes his own social system. Music's a good thing. It calm the beast in the man. American communists have the opportunity to preach freely their ideas. It would be absolutely wrong to hold the Soviet government responsible for activities of the American communists. You cannot make a revolution with silk gloves. Quantity has a quality all its own. Take some exercise. Try to recover the look of a human being. Our Red Army now needs IL-2 aircraft like the air it breathes, like the bread it eats. In the Soviet Union, it takes more courage to retreat than advance. 